the fuck are these people? We'll take a bike ride along Vespucci Beach, and I'll show you just what you want to see. This day was going so well until you showed up, you know that? Ugh! Yeah, well, you're lucky to even be allowed out of the house after that boat stunt. What's the big deal? If anything goes wrong, you can just fake your death and start all over. How am Jimmy. I meant to develop my own moral sensibilities when yours are so unbelievably fuck-faced? I'm going gray listening to this crap. Station change. Fuck yeah, I'm a jam. Don't push me. Seriously, some guys borrow your boat. Borrow? You were hiding in the head crying kidnap. They just took receipt of your property with payment pending. If it was anything other than what you told me, then that's on you. All right, they fucking stole it. And who knows what they would have done if they found me, but I didn't expect or want them to get killed. You think I'm gonna let some guys ride off with my son? Look, I knew you were a bad guy, but- Oh, a bad guy. A crook, a killer, a thief, a liar. I guess I've been all those things one time or another, right? It's just what? <sighs> I always thought I was the good guy. God help the morally bankrupt planet. What the fuck? Now your generation have left you us. And you're the good guy. Yeah. Anyway, I always knew you were the kind of person who didn't let other people get in the way, but I hadn't, like, seen that happen before. Yeah, well, that's me, Jim. And I've been trying my best to get things under control for the last ten years. But that was an extreme fucking situation, and I had to act. A normal person wouldn't have done that. Yeah, well, I had to. To protect you. Hey, yeah, keep telling yourself that when you see their faces every time you close your eyes. Hey, you! Two bites. Take your pick. This one'll do.
like you're buying your own TV. You know, this is real. Shit, shit, shit.
Ocean. I was wondering when you'd show up. I was dead. Praise be. Guess you weren't very dead. You need my help. <coughs> was there something else? Ah, excuse me. I got this interview at this tech company. I'm thinking I need something, I don't know, geeky, youthful. Dignity aside, I think that might just work. Good luck at the interview. Goodbye. Dressed up. Now, you want to run me through this thing? The prototype is somewhere in the Life Invader office. Find it and fit it with the device in your bag. They just gonna let me in? Why wouldn't they if you look the part? Hang around till someone opens the door and act entitled. Fine.
I'm turning consultant when we release. Consulting consultors. You know, a consultancy, consultancy, consultancy. I'm kind of big on the conference tour already. Hi. Oh, hi. Chill out on the beanbag. Marcus will be right out. Oh, um, I'm gonna take a normal chair. I have a terrible back. <laughs> Here you go. If you guys let me use the OS I requested, this wouldn't be a problem. This is a filthy hard drive, bro. Uh, got any antivirus software? I think so. Behind this junk on the left. Clicked an NSFW link, bro. Bit me on the ass. Yeah, not safe for work, huh? You know, my son's computer runs into the same kind of problems. Scanning. You want a massage? Cause my hands are free. <laughs> and that should do it. Why don't you try and keep things strictly safe for work from now on? Hey, have you seen the prototype in the demo room? When Norris announces it at the keynote, minds are gonna blow. Yes, they are. When we go mobile, we'll be able to do all the movies. We'll be able to do That's so cool. Looking at you two, I think it's safe to say this nation is fucked, isn't it? Jay thinks being a quirky douche boosts creativity. <laughs> He's the... Dude, when it blue screens again, you you're my guy. Team, dude. Bye. <laughs> sit, 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 sit. Foot bang, dig back. Oh. Ow! Come on, you're gonna have to learn the foot bag if you want to get a job here, okay? Follow me. Okay. Oh! Some a-hole drank my effing head milk! There was a totally non-passive-aggressive note on it! Hold on, I'll buzz you out. Hold on, hold on. No, they found you! Lester, the thing's in the prototype. I'm going home to watch the keynote. Teabag time, my friend! Lester, did you hear me? Are you playing that game? Yeah, yeah, sorry. The phone is rigged. Now, what's your problem? You don't like shooters? They're all the same. Besides, you know me. I'm a movie guy. Classic Vinewood. Classic Vinewood ended 30 years ago. Now it's just superheroes, romantic comedies, and remakes, none of which interest me. Hey, I believe this country can still make interesting movie. <laughs> oh my god, you guys are so lit. One million dollars and tours around the country. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Jay Norris to the stage. Hey, this company has come a long way since we started it in my parents' pool house in East Caraway. Today, you're about to witness a new phase. Full-on, weapons-grade, red alert, world domination! We have put a billion people's private data in the public domain and we have milked every penny we could in the process. And we have one of the youngest workforces in the world. An average age of only 14.4 years? That's not just impressive, it's revolutionary! Today, right here, we're about to make the next step. 
prepare to witness the future. The Life Invader mobile device. Yes, we've invented something no one else has ever thought of. A small, personal, computerized device. Now you're going to be able to stay docked 24-7. On the bus, you can dock. On the subway, stay docked. You can be docked at home. And at the same time, you're docking with some kids at the public pool. We went to the guys at Fruit Computers and we told them we wanted to make our hardware as compatible as possible. But you know what? They're not interested in sharing their technology. So we went and made it compatible anyway. Now you can dock your Life Invader to an iFood phone or any other device. And it'll take all the data off it and reformat it into Life Invader friendly information. At around this point in my presentation, there was meant to be a call for my product team to introduce the device. But we're experiencing some technical difficulties. Oh, hold on a second. I think someone's trying to dock with me. Hello? Oh! Ah! Security! Oh, Jesus! Whoa! No, no, Let's... no, 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 no. Whoa! That was heavy. Are you watching the news? I don't have to. I'm watching the markets. I'll be trading pure alpha till close. All right. Hey, about that other thing. You know the score. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Put on a suit, look somewhat professional, and meet me at my warehouse off the LS freeway. Oh, uh, and I'm about to email you a link for the exchange. You can put in some trades of your own. I'm trying to stay off the day trading. Uh, but maybe I'll take a look. <laughs> 